think every segment is gonna happen with my cat meow. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that, bro? That's all I want to talk about today. Become irreplaceable. And that could be within your friendship group. That could be within your workplace. That could be within uh, a gameplay group. Like you play games, for example, if you still want that stupid shit. I, I believe it's stupid shit, but if you derive 100% pleasure from playing video games, which most people don't, they're actually, in fact, when they're drones. Don't lick the floor! Okay, don't you don't lick the floor. Just leave! I'm, I'm not stopping this guy from leaving, I don't abuse him as well. He's just terrified, he's a scaredy cat. Oh, look at him. Cute as hell. <laughs> so cute. I think I'm getting a dog next as well. Um, I was getting I was between three breeds. Three breeds. Three breeds. Um, a, ma a husky, a Malibu husky, or any husky of the matter. They're really, really cute, all of them. A uh, golden retriever and a Shiba Inu, a Japanese. How much do they even cost? I'm pretty sure they're quite expensive. Sorry for the delay, and my curiosity has killed me and in this video. Uh, uh, golden retriever. How much is golden retriever? Puppy UK, come on. It is one thousand five hundred pounds to two thousand five hundred pounds, and costs up to three grand. Now nah, wrong, good. <laughs> nah, wrong, good. What breed? Expensive dog, UK English Bulldog, three three K. Jesus, I'm not paying that much. The fuck. How much is is Shiba Inu UK Bro the dog, not the fucking coin man, this crypto shit is killing me. My mom's calling out to the dog, I mean the cat. Eight hundred pounds to a thousand five hundred pounds for a well bred Shiba Inu puppy. Be sure to buy a puppy from a trustworthy breeder. Oh, he's so handsome and cute. Look at him, he's so handsome and cute. Look at him. Oh. This one's fluffy though, this is cuter. It's like a fox dog. Pretty sure that's his name. <laughs> he's so cute. <laughs> it makes us the cutest noise as well. And, um, Malamut Husky Puppy UK. I, I, only three of them. Alaskan, uh, they're quite expensive, aren't they? Mm. I want to get one because then it'd be a pain in the ass to get three. Siberian Huskies. A thousand, bro, it, it's a fucking monthly wage. Uh, it's not worth it. I'm sorry. I want to do that shit. Anyways, become irreplaceable within your friendship group, your workplace, and your game. Let's say social, work, what else? I think the only thing I can really think about. Become irreplaceable, especially as an individual. So if anything come, if everyone comes together, make sure you be the one that makes everyone come together. This is like a tenant in, uh, what is it? How to make friends, uh, make friends and influence people in that book. I haven't read it. I don't, I don't read, I don't read that, those other books. I'm more focused on finance books because those are things, that's the subject we are weakest in. But I'll definitely give it a read. Like I'm not gonna be a stupid guy and not give it a read. I think not giving it a read simply because I I don't think I need it is stupid. But I don't think at the moment that I need it, and I'd rather focus. I am gonna read it, but I'd rather focus on finance. But um, this is like my philosophy when it comes to socializing, and this is why I'm so sociable and so I'm so extroverted. Here is my secret. I talk a lot, a lot, but it isn't about the latest bullshit. It's about more meaningful topics and like funny topics. I don't try to talk about the politics or Meghan Markle or this, that. Sometimes I will see myself to talk about that, that, that shit. But for the most part, I don't talk about that shit. I about meaningful topics that contribute to people's lives. About, I talk about my life, about people's lives, about their goals, other, people, other people's goals. I, talk, I, like, I involve people in the conversation. Like, 
oh yeah, I do this. What about you? What about you? What about you? What about you? Because people are selfish. I'm, I myself, I see myself as selfish as well at some, at some periods. But a lot of people are selfish, and in the pursuit of entrepreneurship and the pursuit of making friends, you, you, for the most part, you have to be selfless. You have to be selflessly selfish, in the sense that you are constantly gauging the other person, you're constantly seeing in, in which how they behave around people, and you're constantly probing on how the, what their behavior is like. Obviously, you need to do that as well because you need to know if they can be a real friend or not. But you're doing that because people love talking about themselves. And you're doing that so you can see if the person is actually worthy of being your friend. Anyways, I'm going back on the be irreplaceable. When an event happens and there's a bunch of people that gather around, make sure you're the host. Make sure you're the person responsible for gathering everyone around. And this is unisex advice, but it usually applies to male people more, male audiences more. Girls just, for the most part, go along with the flow. But a guy is like, you gotta get shit together. Like girls, you can take life a bit slow, chillax, you know, you can find a nice guy and everything, all that type of, sh all type of shit. Obviously, if you're a super disciplined, hyper disciplined, hyper focused woman, I think that's still great. Like, it's put a more masculine energy woman, but I, I kind of like tomboys, so I kind of like masculine energy women, so I don't care. But for the most part, you can just be chill, relax, have fun, yada yada, party. Make sure if any party happens, make sure you're the one organizing that shit. Secondly, if anything fun happens, if any, if, if any group comes together, make sure you're the one responsible for it. And this is different. This is different from the party. How? This is different from the party because it applies more broadly to a large a range of subjects. For example, I remember I made a video a while back. Damn, I, I got an itchy ass head, man. Fuck. Dirty skin. Let me clean the house this morning. I had a, my mop right here. It's wet. <laughs> I'm gonna mop the house again in a minute. Uh, yeah, my room's pretty dry, so I'll, I'll mop the house in a minute after I finish recording this video. My friends, I used to, like, out. Lavanya,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先生,先
I want to upload this video at least. Today is the 8th of March, 2023. It is currently 2.05 p.m. And today I woke up at 4.45 a.m. Quite the military disciplined individual, if I do say so myself. Uh, glad, glad I got my chunt and cut at quickly before someone else robbed that shit. And now I am at chun and cut. I just changed my, my intro video from testing, testing, something else. Mm, 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 nah. I like the testing, testing video, it's kind of funny. Nah, I need to change it. What minutes are we on? What, 10 minutes? I'll be chilling. We're chilling for another 5 minutes. Okay. So my game, in my game frame group, it's so scuffed. This video is scuffed as fuck. I did better on my computer and changed my bio. I'm, I apologize. Nowhere to auto tune. Lonely. I'm so lonely. I have nobody. All on my own. Lonely. I have nobody. 16 year old taking steroids. God damn. What an absolute mongoloid. I got, um, currently I got a, a thumbnail blocker on YouTube, and it's quite, quite useful. So I just, I, I would end up watching that video, but because of the thumbnail blocker, I just close the tab. No watching that video. Anyways, back in my friend group. I apologize. <laughs> oh, I apologize. For my friend group, I always used to be the person that brought everyone together. Especially with any other event as well, but especially with this, I always. But with any other event, of course, I brought everyone together. With the fighting event, I brought everyone together. With the Discord game shop, I brought everyone together. With the ADHD podcast, I brought everyone together. I started those events. Of course, those ideas aren't original. Of course, they aren't. In fact, it was me and my friend, and it was like twenty percent me and eight percent of my friend thinking about it. But but then my friend did nothing, and then I did all the work, and bro was trying to still claim. The idea, I'm like, shut the fuck up. You, you, that's not an idea. Okay, shut up. Action. An idea is worthless until there's action placed on the idea. All right. Remember that, guys. Anyways, I was with. In, I remember being in the gaming group that I was, I was in, and I really like these guys. I still do like them, but however, I gotta distance myself from them. Like the fuck. Am I just gonna stay a, a gaming geek forever? No. There has to be periods in which I miss the gaming sessions. But then I choose to be choose the discipline. I choose the discipline path. I choose the greater thing, the thing that I actually need to do at the time, comparatively to just the gaming, the instant gratification, the hedonism, the pleasure. It's not even pleasure. I don't think I denounce. I denounce. Uh, and obviously, I, I did. I did denounce ounce of pleasure from gaming. But looking back, most of the nostalgia, most of all that shit, was because of my friends, not necessarily because of the game. Gaming itself is just a medium in which you connect with uh, your, your friends. But then that medium is weak. Therefore, your friends aren't really your friends. And they're just gaming friends thereafter. If you understand what I'm saying, like if you were to stop playing that game, to stop using that drug, video games is a drug. Come on, guys. It makes you addicted to it. It is a drug. It consumes your life. It is a drug. Once you remove video games as the cool medium in which you communicate with other people, the cool weak medium, you end up stop communicating with people or you forego communication with people, these people, and then after that, all your common interests are just video games, and video games aren't even real in the first place. So often there's a weird other argument that I need to bring up. Anyways, I always used to bring these guys together, and after... Hello? I'm from Wow! Get that out of here. After a while, like, I stopped calling. I said to uh, these guys, yeah, I'm gonna distance myself from you guys. I have to, I have to work on this, I have to work on that. And ever since then, I've seen myself like, boost in productivity so much more. I recently got back to video editing and I actually started enjoying the process more than anything else. I'm really grateful that I did. My cat. I'm really grateful that I did, but I still remember like the the thought of my video today was become irreplaceable. 
I, these guys can't replace me. They can call and whatever, and they can still go about their shit, but it's never gonna be the same without me. That's what I mean. But what's that mean? That's what I mean by saying become irreplaceable. If you're working a job, like a sales job, get so many sales for the company that without you, the company crashes. Without you, the company buckles and falls into bankruptcy and loses growth and loses investors. Become irreplaceable and become outstanding as an individual. I wouldn't say go as far as it's outstanding for me to go and bring everyone together for a gaming group. I, all I did was call them and then nag them to come on and then check up on them regularly and then fucking play with the video games for a few hours. It wasn't that bad, right? I said it a lot as a list, it sounded like a lot of it isn't. But at some point, there was, there's a very low ROI in doing this. I don't give myself time to miss them. And I don't give myself time to even think. I'm becoming like some slave type character, which I don't want to be. I dissed myself from them. And they said, one of them said to me, Oh, you're going to make it weird. You're, there's something, 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 something. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Recently, they were talking on the chat. And you know what I did? I left them on scene. And I forgot about it. I wasn't like, oh yeah, I'm leaving them on scene. I'm so cool. No, I just went on back with the work that I need to do. I'm not going to sit there and then allow myself to be a waste of space, a waste of t like wasting my time like that. It's a waste of my time for, to call you down. I, I, I made a video a while back of, of how frustrated I was, of how angry I was, because I, did, I didn't feel appreciated at the time. They took me for granted. So I just left. And I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy being alone. <laughs> I got my boxing friends still, and I'm slowly making that transition, which I want to talk about before, which Ham's talk about as well. Being happy. Like, if you're surrounded with these gamer friends, you're just gonna feel alienated and how do I say this? Exonerated? Not exonerated, that's the wrong word. Extradited? Extradited. Um, alienated and. What happened to John Wick in the movie? He got. What did the Continental do to John? They something, extra something. The joint parallelum. Execution, no wrong. They call self defense a dinner reservation. Excommunicado. How on earth would I remember a, a complicated word like that? Like, excommunicado. Are you serious? Stupid. <sighs> Stupid. Um, I bet there is something like the content of real life. I don't care though. Come on, criminal. I, I thought excommunicated within this group that I... In which I brought everyone together. I thought alienated within this group. So I left. That's what. That's what. That is what's called having self-respect for yourself. I put that wrong. That's what self-respect is called. Well, that's what having self-respect. That's what. Fuck <laughs> That's what's called self-respect. Yeah, I'll just say that. I respect myself enough not, not to waste my time with this. And one of them said to me, "Oh, you're gonna regret this." No. No. Not really. I got my cat. Oh, my work to do in front of me. I hear their voices all the time because I was gaming with them. I don't care. I don't think you possibly understand this. I'll send this video to them. I don't care. 
Because as an individual on self improvement, you're gonna be going with this gamer group of friends, and you're gonna stay in the exact same place with the same exact, exact gamer group, uh, gamer group friends, right? There needs to be a period in which you stop gaming, you stop surrounding yourself with these gamer group friends, you stop wasting your life on this shit. If, if, you're, if you're getting paid, like you're doing streaming and you're doing clips and you're doing YouTube videos, fair enough. What can I say? I think that's quite productive actually, if, if anything, that's good. Um, they called the John Wick uh, fan, uh, Wikipedia, the John Wiki. It's quite smart. You have to go through a period in which you stop talking to these people. Even even right now, because I've played so many games, because I indulge in hedonism and pleasure and bullshit, I often find myself incredibly distracted. It's very easy to be distracted in this modern world. Like most people that will watch this video, I, thought, I don't have to check the watch time, but I guarantee you, most people watch this video, they watch for like a minute or 10 minutes or like five minutes and they get the va they get the value out of the video and then they just quit. Or they skim through the video, or they skip through like with a fucking button, five second, five second, five second, looking through the video, looking for the best part. The whole video is the best part. Like, do you not understand that? Fuck man. Anyways, because of me, the group was together and we all had fun for a while. And it, it is quite nostalgic looking back. It is fun looking back at times. I agree. But I did feel alienated a lot of times. So like, like it was like one percent fun, nine percent, nine nine percent. No, it was a ten percent fun, ten twenty seven percent fun, eighty to ninety percent feeling alienated, feeling left behind, feeling just excommunicated from the entire group that I brought together. So I left. There's low ROI on that. I left. And I don't regret it at all. I feel quite happy actually. Walk forward to my fitness journeys, forward to my financial journeys. I don't care. I want to meet people that are similar to me and similar to my age. They could be 20 or 25. I don't care. I'm still similar ish to my age, like 7 years. 7 years is nothing. But. Obviously, in the grand scheme of things, it is quite substantial. It's almost a decade. But to me, I don't see people for the age. I see people for the personality. How you present yourself. My last point that I was going to touch on. Ever since then, ever since I stopped talking to them, the group died. <laughs> the group died. There's no chats on the group chat. There's no, there's no group chat, there's no chats in the group chats. The chat's completely dead. I can't even find it. Oh, here it is. The last chat was... How do I... Information. Saturday. Saturday. Twenty six Thursday, Saturday. Today is Wednesday. Four days. Pretty dead fucking chat. Pretty dead chat. Mind you, we used to talk every single fucking day. I was carrying this shit with the weight, on, with all the weight on my back. I was tired of carrying this shit. Bye. I don't care, guys. You might think I was a ruthless individual, but obviously I am a ruthless individual. I don't want to be around people that don't like me. They don't appreciate me for the person that I am. They take me for granted. I don't like those type of individuals. I'll drop you as quick as a hat. I find myself unappreciated. I might check up with you sometimes to be nice. Which is what I think everyone should do. It's nice to check up with you. It costs nothing. And it costs me nothing to just say, hey, how are you being? Are you okay? Are you good in health? Etc. Etc. But I'm not going to be friends with you. There is no friendship. If anything, the friendship is dismantled in my eyes. We don't talk anymore. We don't talk anymore. We don't talk anymore. We don't talk anymore like we used to do. <coughs> Damn. I don't sing often. But I'm looking at this Box Wife project thing, East London. I might go to this boxing gym for 18 years. I'm 17. I'm 18 in four months, guys. Four months and two days. 
How long until 10th July? 124 days. Uh, quite long actually to say it like that. 126 days, 7 hours, 50, 59 minutes, and 55 seconds to go. To go! That's my birthday, guys. Wish me happy birthday. And it's like, it ties in with that first time video, become a ruthless cunt. If you're not willing to cut people that don't appreciate you, and you feel used and abused within the, within the relationship, then you, you're showing you have no self-respect. You don't value yourself in the slightest. And this, this, this is levels. If you don't value yourself, no one will value you. I value myself heavily. I put myself on the pedestal. Because if I don't put myself on the pedestal, then no one else, no one else is going to put me on the pedestal. And no one gives a fuck. Nobody gives a fuck, alright? That's about it. What's the community commissions? Community. Can I, can I? Uh, we don't talk anymore. We don't talk anymore. We don't talk anymore like we used to do. Future Dimitri. Eligible, but my phone number. Oh, custom thumbnail. I have to get this verified. Live streaming. I just care about the thumbnails and the video is longer than 15 minutes. That's about it. It says verify phone number. It didn't accept my phone number last time because it said it, I had too many channels. But it only takes a year. Does my tablet have a SIM card? Uh, I'm using my brain, using all my brain cells. You don't talk anymore. You don't talk anymore. Let me check real quick. Oh, no. no. Oh, 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 oh. Where's my phone? Where's my phone? Yes, 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 yes. It allows it. I'm not, I'm not saying the code. Are you stupid? Are you stupid, Barav? Barav. Woo! 27 minute video, here we go! Soon! Soon! That's fucking cold, bro. Finally, uh, enable the advanced features. Enable create more shorts daily. Create mid life that 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 enable to apply for monetization. Wow, video verification. Bro, uh, literally all this channel is is my face. Video verification. What are you talking about, bro? What are you talking about, little bro? Oh my god, I thought I don't edit other videos. What a I only got like 200 views, man. I'm happy. I'm happy, guys. I'm satisfied. I'm gonna get big 1 million subscribers on YouTube. <laughs> Just because I verified my, my channel with my phone. Only two channels can be verified per year. It's 2023. New year, new me. That would quite have to spin. Catch you guys in the next video, Sui. Stay relentless. No, no. I don't. That Jesse James was. It's, it's a nice quote, but it's fucking it's a bit zesty. I don't care if it's zesty, but uh, to me, it's a bit, to me it's zesty. I don't. I don't. I like it. Um, end quote. End quote. End quote. Man. Man. I don't care. Bye, guys. Have a lovely day. No, it's not. Hmm, have a lovely day. I do want you to have a lovely day. What should I say to you? I'm not gonna mop my house. What the fuck am I doing? Sui. Do you. Do you s salute with right hand. right or left hand? UK. I'll be doing my left hand the entire time. What else want me? Right hand, British Army. <laughs> Sui. Catch you in the next video. This is this better stop recording, bro. Oh my god, I didn't stop recording it. Oh, uh, oh, look at this fucking broom. Get out of here, man. Bitch. Don't fuck me. It's a broom. I can't see.